This is breaking news on WDSU. Good afternoon, everybody. Breaking news right now at 4 o'clock. The New Orleans police officer convicted for the burning of the body of Henry Glover in the days after Hurricane Katrina will not be granted a new trial. We just now know this. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Camille Whitworth. And I'm Scott Walker. The officer, Gregory McRae, could still spend less time in jail. WDSU reporter Travers Mackle has details on why one charge here was thrown out. Travers. Scott, the federal appeals court for this area found that a recent Supreme Court ruling in another case involving destruction of records requires that one obstruction charge against McCray now be tossed out. That means the district judge, Lance Afric, will have to recalculate McCray's sentence. Depending on Judge Afric's decision, McCray could get a reduced sentence. He's currently serving 17 years after a jury found that he burned the body of Henry Glover and then tried to cover up that crime. That happened in the days following Hurricane Katrina, but McCray was convicted in 2010. A hearing to recalculate McCray's sentence is set for one week from today. The appeals court also denied a request for a new trial for McCray, who remains the only former NOPD officer serving time in the death of Glover. Back in 2010, five former officers went to trial for Glover's death. The 31 year old was shot outside a strip mall in Algiers and his body burned behind the 4th District NOPD station in Algiers. Right Two other former officers were acquitted at trial. One had his conviction tossed out, and the shooter, David Warren, who was initially convicted, was later granted a new trial where he was found not guilty. Camille? All right, Travers, with that update, thank you so much.